EAF, Emergency Assistance Fund, in my own words, is a lending hand in a time of high financial needs, an oasis in the middle of a desert. My name is Rudy Hernandez Jr. I am happily married to my wife, Ruby. I am a father of two beautiful kiddos. I started working for the Greater Green Bay YMCA back in 2017 as a 21C at-risk after-school staff. Since then, I transitioned to a youth development specialist and to now a youth program manager. Summer of 2023, I transitioned to a part-time role because of financial needs and at the time, the coming of a second child. As many parents know, childcare is expensive. Not to mention the fear of trusting others with your children. All that played a role with transitioning to a part-time role and being a stay-at-home father. My wife and I, after many months of financial preparation, we came up with a plan to survive as she remained full-time. On my first day of my part-time role, I was bombarded with unforeseen hospital bills and just many other unexpected expenses. We quickly turned into a place of high stress and a route to financial failure. I had a great weight on my shoulders. If my wife and I weren't able to provide, it could lead all the way to homelessness. I was going through a lot of stress and a lot of frustration and a lot of fear that we wouldn't be able to make ends meet. Everything changed when I met my mentor. In our monthly meetings, I shared my life situation and he reminded me about EAF and I thought about it for a few days. It takes a lot to ask for help. After much days of pondering, I decided to apply for an EAF grant. Staying busy and trying to earn a buck, I received an email saying that we've been selected for the EAF grant. Quickly, within days, I used the money, made payments, and milked it out to get back on track. I'm not sure where I would be without the EAF. The success that my family has had with the EAF has been very high. My family and I, we're able to get back on track and make ends meet. We are extremely grateful, and we want to thank everybody who has contributed to the EAF committee and any other person who is considering and donating to it. My family and I are in a better place because of the EAF.